as the truck barreled through Brooklyn, hitting pedestrians, the people who saw it all happen were in complete shock. CBS 2's Christina Fan live in Bay Ridge, where she spoke to witnesses earlier. Christina? Well, Maurice and Christine, it was a terror-filled morning here in Brooklyn as people scrambled to get out of harm's way. According to witnesses, the driver was not only speeding, he was also going down the wrong direction on some roads. And here in the intersection behind us, he first clipped a moped before mounting the sidewalk. Debris lay strewn across seven crime scenes in Brooklyn as police tried to retrace the suspect's violent path. For the dozens of people who bore witness to the indiscriminate rampage, the images are hard to shake. The guy who got hit was in the middle of the road. He was like bleeding all over. His head was covered of blood. Witnesses say around 10:30 this morning they heard a loud bang, followed by the sound of metal scraping near Fifth Avenue and Bay Ridge Parkway. When they ran outside, they saw a U-Haul with what appeared to be a bicycle trapped underneath, along with a victim suffering from severe head injuries. We looked out the window and saw a U-Haul truck coming down. Down the road and going on the wrong side of the road, and he was dragging a motorbike. We saw all the, the belongings of whoever was driving it. Moments later, surveillance video caught the same U Haul near 72nd Street and 3rd Avenue, hitting a moped before mounting a sidewalk, narrowly missing this pedestrian as police gave chase. If he didn't jump, too fast like that, he would be underneath the truck. Because the guy who was driving, I don't know what this maniac was doing and what he was running from the cops for. Although the NYPD now says the attack does not appear to be terror related, families at first feared the worst, remembering an ISIS inspired 2017 rampage in Manhattan that killed eight people. It looked a little bit like a terrorist type of thing because it looked like everybody was like panicked, you know? People were getting panicked. And uh, I mean, the, the police department and the ambulance came pretty fast. Yeah. You know, they did an amazing job just picking these guys up and taking them straight to the hospital. And again, of those eight victims, we have learned that two of them are in critical condition, two of them in serious condition. The other four have minor injuries. We are live from Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. Okay, Christina, thank you.